I don't believe it! Professor Natquick? Oh, I don't believe it! Barnacles! <laughs> Did you call for help? Yes, yes! I was beginning to think that nobody heard me. <laughs> Octonauts, this is Professor Natquick. When I was a young polar scout, he taught me how to do field research in the Arctic. And I'm happy to see you remember what I taught you. How to recognize tracks, how to listen for sounds that others miss, and... <laughs> how to dodge one of my surprise snowballs. <laughs> Very good, Barnacles. Thanks, but what are you doing so far from home, Professor Natquick? I came here to do research in the Antarctic many years ago. No one knew you were still here. My radio broke long ago, but I couldn't leave. I'm on the edge of amazing discovery. But it may soon be lost. Lost? Why? Follow me. Click, click. This is why I called for help. <gasps> I realized that the ice was moving and pulling the station into this enormous ice chasm. When it falls in... All of your work goes with it. And disappears forever. As you can see, it could fall in at any moment. Then we've no time to lose. Tweak? We can pull this ass research station to safety faster and you can say bunch of munchy crunchy <laughs> frozen carrots. Octonauts, let's do this. No spikes! Thank you, Octonauts. You saved the station and my life's work. Now I can share my amazing discovery. Follow me. Click, click. I always pounce on the chance to investigate a strange new sound. When I arrived in Antarctica, I discovered this. The bloop sound. But who or what was making it? That was question. I tracked the sound deep in the ice until finally I discovered that the mysterious bloop is made by... A humongous blooptopus. No, it's... A gigantic bloopzilla. No. A monstrous blooperoceros. No, no. The bloop sound is made by enormous ice quakes. Ice quakes? Yes, yes. Is the sound the ice makes when it breaks... Actually, it looks like I've got you. I got the octopus! I won't be able to follow that pup anywhere if that octopus gets her first. Uh, I know. Ah, take a shot! <laughs> Tweak's new camouflage worked like a charm. That old octopus thought I was a... <gasps> take a shot! Wait! I'm not really a tiger shark, I... Oh, these little pups really do get confused by the cups. Quasi to Shellington. I'm following one of the hammerhead pups, and she's a wild one. Good work, Quasi. Don't lose her now. Well, that's two of the hammerhead pups. Just one more to find. I can smell food. I just can't see it. <laughs> you can't get away from me. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, my head is stuck. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Hey, somebody help! Look, down there. The third hammerhead. And he's stuck. We're the Octonauts. We're here to help. <laughs> he's really stuck. We'd better call for backup. There, the last one. Peso, Quasi, come in. We found the third pup, but his head is stuck. We need your help. Stuck? We've got to help me, brother! Captain, we're on our way! <laughs> come on, our brother's in trouble! Oh, no! Ahoy, Peso! These little pups put up a good chase, don't they? You're telling me? 
so. Quasi, over here. Oh, oh, ouch. This does me feel too good. Some slippery ointment should help slide his hammerhead out. Good idea. Everyone else, grab a fin. There. Don't worry. We'll have you out and swimming in no time. On my count, everyone pull. Ready? Three, two, one. Uh, guys, look behind me. Oh, fascinating. Hammerhead's eyes allow them to see what's behind them, like that. Shark! <gasps> this should give him something to chew on. Hey, those things don't taste too good, do they? I'm sure you'd taste a lot better. <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, bet you can't catch me. <laughs> Peso, follow me and bring your friend. Different kinds of whale lice live on different kinds of whale. We have to work out which whale species this louse came from. I'm running a scan now. There. Looks like this louse came from a sperm whale. There's no time to lose. Octonauts, let's do this. <laughs> We'll have this louse out of you in no time, just as soon as we find him a sperm whale. There's something big coming up. A vast! It's a whale! Oh, but it's a blue whale, not a sperm whale. Hmm, keep looking, everyone. There! Nope, that's a humpback whale. I knew that. Starting to feel a little faint. Oh, you're feeling faint. How do you think I feel? <laughs> Hurry, Captain. They're getting worse. We're coming up on another well now. Uh, can't tell what kind it is, Captain. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, a sperm wheel! Excellent. Peso, you'd better suit up and. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, you stay away from my baby. Oh, the whale's mother. Sperm whales will do anything to protect their young. Hang on, everyone. The mother whale's not giving up. Peso, Quasi, I'll keep her distracted. You get the louse on her. But how are we going to do that? Mr. Louse, this is it. Oh, oh, I don't know if I can make it. Oh, for goodness sake. But this is where you belong, on a sperm whale. I'm just too weak. Hurry, Peso. I don't know how long I can keep her distracted. I've run into some complications, Captain. I'm going to have to perform an emergency lousectomy. Lousectomy? Lousectomy? But I'll need my medical bag. Tell me what you need, matey! Tweezers, Quasi. I need tweezers. <sighs> now I can't see inside you, so let me know when I'm getting close. A little, a little to the left. Steady. <gasps> we brought quite a bit of kelp back with us, Professor. Ah. Yeah. Hmm. I think you may have brought something other than kelp back as well. Dashi, can you zoom in? Zooming in, Professor. <gasps> Leafy sea dragons. I completely missed them. Leafy sea dragons are easy to miss. They're small and they're experts at camouflage. If they were stuck to the gap, then they must be in the octopod. But where? We'll search for them right away. And since these little leafy sea dragons look exactly like kelp... We'll need these octagoggles set to camouflage mode. We'll be able to see any living creature, even if it blends in perfectly with its surroundings. Shellington, you check the lab. Dashy, you take the sick bay. Tweak and I will search the launch bay. 
Octonauts, let's do this. Did you see them? Nothing but plain old kelp in here. Hmm, no sign of them here. The leafy sea dragons aren't here either. Let's see, who else took some of that kelp? <gasps> Quasi! Quasi! Stop that stew! Quasi! Chopper! Pow! Boil! Chop! Chopper! Pow! Boil! Octonauts, to the kitchen! Chop! The last little bit of kelp coming up, mateys! Oh, nowhere to hide! What's pirate for don't eat me? Stop that stew! <coughs> what did you say, Captain? Stop that stew! Those are leafy sea dragons, not kelp! What? Where? In your paw! Shiver me whiskers! <laughs> Do your worst, pirate! But, but don't hurt us! I'm not gonna hurt you, mateys. I thought you were kelp. But you're a pirate! I'm also an octonaut. And octonauts help little critters like you. I think you'd just like to go back home. Yes, but we need to find our dad first. A strong current of water carried him away. Quasi, sound the octo alert!